guys welcome back to my channel so as you can already tell by the title of this video I'm gonna show you guys how I straightened my hair yes so I have some changes um, to my hair routine that I'll be discussing in another video but this is more about just the process that I use now keeping in mind I'm not going for a bone straight hair whatsoever um i first and foremost care about the health of my hair so most of this is just i used about one pass maybe two passes if i kind of messed up and didn't hold my straightener in the right position for the first pass but for uh the majority it's just one pass and as you'll see um at the end result, my hair was quite poofy because I do have a lot of hair and it was very thick and poofy. Now, I had just um, put my hair into two flat twists overnight and then I got this like cute little wavy look. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and jump into the prep. So when you straighten your hair, prepping your hair for this process, everything from the wash to the blow dry is so important and they determine what your results are gonna look like. So I'm gonna show you guys what I use for the prep process. So first up, I used my Uncle Funky Daughter's Squeaky Cleansing Shampoo. I love this, it has a beautiful like um, citrus scent to it and it's really light, like the consistency is almost, I almost wanna say runny but not quite. So it's not like a lot of other shampoos that are super thick and it always just gets the job done. I do end up with product buildup and sweat because I'm very active. So this was just super key. Whatever you use, you always wanna make sure you use a cleansing shampoo when you straighten, not a cleansing conditioner because you want your hair to be completely free of product. So next up, I use a um, protein like strengthening conditioner to strengthen my hair, you know, for all the manipulation that it's going to go through. And I recently got this. This is the Rusk. Um, it's like strengthening conditioner. I got this at Target for like 10 bucks. It's huge. It's like 33.8 fluid ounces. So it's going to last me forever. And I'm all about the scents. I felt like when I smell this, I'm in like an English garden drinking like mint tea. It's just, that's how it is. Like, I don't know, it's just so amazing. Um, but what I love is that it's not overly like saturated with protein so much that your hair feels like completely dry and stripped. It was like just the right amount for me. And then finally to deep condition, I used my Joico uh, Moisture Recovery Treatment Balm. Now I have a wash day with um, this and the shampoo. If you guys wanna check that out, I will link it up for you above. And I also um, layered, I had a hemp seed oil and then I layered it on top of this and that's how I deep conditioned and I sat under a hooded dryer for about 30 minutes. So that was my whole prep process. Immediately after that, I went into blow drying. Well, that's a lie. <laughs> I went into applying my leave-in conditioners and then blow drying and then straightening. So I'm gonna show you guys, we're gonna pick up right on that.
guys, so that's it. Um, if you guys are new to my channel, please, please subscribe. And if you liked this, give me a thumbs up. That way I know what videos you guys like and what kind of videos I should stop doing. Um, maybe if you want me to talk more about my hair routine, give this a thumbs up too. That way I'll make sure to go ahead and do that for you guys. Um, and I hope you guys are having a fabulous day and I will see you guys in the next one. Love you guys. Bye.